been coming down quite hard here on the 6th. Nice to see Casey Jarvis, one of our top amateurs, getting for Michael today, even though they're both in contention on the order of merit. Nice chip there by Michael, but he'll have quite a lengthy putt to save par. Puts a nice stroke on that one. Unfortunately, just slipping past. This one for his bogey. Knocking that one in nicely, limiting the damage to just one over. Back to minus five for the tournament. Jean now for her par. Nicely done. Remains at five under for the tournament. Doing the ladies proud here on IGT Tour. Tanda from the fairway having to bring it up and around the trees. Done that quite nicely, leaving himself an uphill birdie opportunity. Getting comfortable over the putt. Nice positive stroke. Solidly in the center. Moving him to seven under. Jason now. Also for birdie. Up the slight slope. Fortunate that one. Just missing on the low side. Should be able to tap that in. Remain at seven under. Armand now. This par attempt. Left himself a little bit of work but cleaned up nicely. Still at six under. Harry coming in over the trees. Centered of the green. Very safe play. He'll have an uphill birdie putt. Keelan now was a bit strong off the tee, also coming in up over the trees. Judged that one quite nicely, leaving himself about 10 feet for birdie. Harry doesn't waste much time with the putter. He's tracking nicely, unfortunately coming up a couple of inches short. But from that distance, I'm sure you'll be happy with the two putt. Had a double and a single, and one birdie up to now, dropped two shots, but he'll continue to work. Keelan currently leading the tournament now after six holes. Try and see if he can extend his lead to two shots. That one, unfortunately, just turning over the lip. Tap in for Paul to remain at 11 under. Currently, our tournament leader. Ricky, with his par putt. Stroke that in nicely. Fortunately, two over for his round so far today.